Hi guys, thank you so much for clicking the video. And for today's vlog guys, uh, welcome again 2023. Okay, so alam na natin 2023, marami na namang job opportunities. And of course, ito na naman yung interview days. Okay, para maka-apply as a call center uh, agent. Okay, so I would like to tackle guys um, yung four common mistakes though, because I've studied a few uh scenarios nowadays sa mga iba't ibang vloggers as well na napansin ko yung tamang scenario no, na normally nagkakamali yung mga uh, call center applicants okay so yun yung itatakel natin for today all right so four common mistakes during interviews let's start with number 1 um you're staying in the company for a short period of time. So, tandaan nyo guys, during job interviews, dapat at least lang guys ha, bigyan natin yung interview word na at least you will stay in the company for 5 years. Okay? Although, at back of your mind, you'll only stay there for 2 years, you just need uh, some few bucks, some pesos para mag-apply kung saan-saan, sa abroad or anything, anywhere. <laughs> okay? Give them at least 5 years. Okay? Don't be too honest, honestly guys, kasi of course, gusto namang interviewer long term. Okay? Para at least hindi sila interview ng interview kasi the more you stay in the company, the more you will be better and you will be, a, you know, a better employee para sa kanila. So that's why gusto nila talaga is at least longer time. Alright? So that's mistake number one. Now, what's mistake number two? Mistake number two is too much hand gestures, too much expression, okay? Yung iba kasi guys, um, during the interview, parang hindi mo na malaman yung kamay eh. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, they're explaining something and they're like, you know, your, your, their hands is all over and then they're, you know, somehow they're telling already different stories far from the question. So, gusto ko lang guys, i-focus nyo balik sa ano ba talaga yung kinwestyon ng no? interviewer. Okay? Um, and, and focus there. If ever, magkaroon ka ba ng side story, at least dapat nakafocus sa answer ni interviewer. Okay? So, that's number two. Too much expression, too much hand gestures, that's a big no-no. Alright? And uh, number three, guys, okay? Ito, frequent na tanong to, nakakatawa, pero merong mga gantong applicants, no? Tinanong sila, how would you like me to address you? Right? It's a common question. Kung ano tatawag ko sa'yo, di ba? Kasi simula na ng interviewan, eh. How would you like me to address you? Tapos mabanatan mo ng address mo, eh. <laughs> Guys, gulong ka na nun. I mean... <laughs> Siguro 50% bagsa ka na nun, man, guys. So, okay, ha? focus kayo dito sa question na to. How would you like me to address you? You can simply answer them this way. You can address me by my first name. Okay, that's it. Ibig sabihin, tawagin mo na lang ako using my first name. If your name is Ronald, just like me, ganda ng pangalan mo, baka 100% pasado ka <laughs> Okay, no, I'm just kidding. But anyway, guys, yun yun ah. So, yun yung number three. And then lastly, number four, guys, if you are applying for an international account, guys, as much as possible, wag, you know, focus on the English language, okay? Don't ever use uh, Tagalog anywhere in your sentence. Kahit yung interjection mo, yung ah, uh, ah, uh, at least, um, ganun ka man, <laughs> Right? Use the interjection na pang, pang kanurin. Okay? Yung mga sure, mga ganun-ganun. Of course, mga ganun-ganun mong mga banat, no? Try to use uh, language, uh, English language all the time. Alright? So that at least uh, maganda yung impression sa'yo na uh, ng interviewer. Alright? Guys, sum up ko lang ng uh, four things, okay? Uh, if you were asked if you would like to stay in the company, tell them at least five years. Okay? Avoid too much hand expression, okay? Yung mga pagalaw-galaw na ganyan. Mahahabang kwento, wala na sa topic. That's a big no-no. And, of course, yung how would you like me to address you? Okay, importante yung guys. Just focus on your first name, kung ano nakalagay sa resume. Number four, if it's an international account, guys, focus on the English language. Alright? So, that's it for today, guys. Thank you so much. And, I'll see you again next time. Bye for now. 
Ay, o nga pala guys, uh, nakalimutan kong sabihin sa inyo yung pinaka-importante sa lahat, okay? And that is to subscribe to my channel, <laughs> alright? I'm in a call center world for almost 14, 15 years. I don't know. I'm a technical support now in Teletech. And if you have any questions, just feel free to ask. I'll answer them. Okay, so see you again the next time. Bye.